I'm Melissa Wright in Omaha, where I spoke to a neighbor who says she woke up to a bat caught in her shower curtains and ended up calling the police. Now, calling the police is extreme, and you are asked not to call unless it's an emergency. However, August is the peak month for calls when it comes to bats inside of buildings. So I went to experts to ask what to do if you are in that situation. Jamari Whiteside says she woke up to strange noises in her bathroom. When she investigated, she discovered a bat. Whiteside says she called the Humane Society, Pest Control, the apartment's maintenance team, and even the police. I was scared. The only thing was going through my mind was, I don't want to get bit. She believes the bat came from the hole above her bathtub. Like the noises, I don't know if the bat like was more scared of us, but like he literally, as soon as we turned on the bathroom light, he was flying around and it sounded like he was crying and squealing, like he wanted to get out. I contacted Steve Glant with the Humane Society to find out more about what to do if this happens to you. They say do not attempt to remove it yourself. Call them for help. Watch where it goes and most importantly, seek medical attention if you, someone else, or an animal has direct contact with a bat. Glant says there are some situations where the Humane Society will not respond to calls and they recommend calling a bat removal service. So that's going to be if it's in an attic space or a crawl space or something like that. Or if they saw it, and, but they're like, I don't know where it is now. Um, then we can't spend, we, we answer so many of these calls, we can't spend uh, a, a lot of time, you know, searching, you know, throughout a house for it. Since the incident, Whiteside says she's working to get the hole fixed by her landlord. According to NHS, they've been to this complex three other times this year for back calls. But I'm just grateful that, like, I got a like I got a gut feeling that told me like no there is something in your bathroom he needs to get up and go check and he closed the bathroom door. So far this year the Nebraska Humane Society has responded to over 900 calls and in the month of August over 160. In Midtown, I'm Melissa Wright.